than people who didn't have cancer. Now, here's meteorologist Michelle Muscatello with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. All right, Michelle, a little cloudy over the weekend, but the sun was shining on one woman in particular. My grandmother, Meme, Martina Little, there she is, uh. turned 101 this weekend. So we had her out to the uh, polo match for her birthday at Glen Farm in Portsmouth. And I'll tell you what, for 101, she's... She looks oh, fantastic. She's an inspiration. She needs to write down whatever she's been doing and share it with the rest of us because yeah. she looks amazing. And Congratulations, her And her Meme. sister is 102. They're both going strong. So uh, hi, He's got I, a I, lot of well. good years <laughs> left in him. That's what we're learning from all of this. All right, live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar over Rhode Island, southeastern Massachusetts. Uh, dry skies, despite all the clouds around. You know, the sun's trying to peak out up to our north and even some of our you know, far northern suburbs getting a couple of breaks in the cloud cover. Live city cam pictures out over Providence right now. All right, I had to really look hard. But right under this city cam, where it says city cam, right there, a little break in the cloud cover. See a little sliver of blue? We're going to get into a little bit more of that this afternoon. I'll still call it mostly cloudy for today for most areas. 69, the temperature, calm winds, humidity at 73%. All right, it's 73 in Johnston, 68 in Cumberland, 67 right now in Newport and Narragansett. So another cool day. This actually should say 67 from Armand and uh, Pawtucket. But Stephen Works is 70, the sun peaking out. Brad in Cumberland, 71. Cloudy, but mild. Here's the satellite and radar, and you can see again where those clouds are thinning up to our north. Also, some showers just skirting across northern New England right now. Looks like most of these are going to miss us up to the north, and that's exactly what our computer models have been saying. But I'm going to be watching for some development over Pennsylvania and New York State this afternoon, because as that front heads our direction, there is the chance later on today for just a spot shower. Most areas should stay dry through the afternoon at about 72 to 76 for temperatures when the little ones are getting off of the bus. Now, to get up into the mid-70s and even a few upper 70s, we got to see a little bit more sun. And the future cast does show that trying to break out this afternoon. couple of spotty showers again rolling through. At 1130 at night, any showers that are still around move off the coastline. And the trend after midnight should be for skies to clear. We'll get back to sunshine tomorrow. A beautiful day on Tuesday. Big area of high pressure and control. Light winds, lots of sunshine from start to finish. So hang in there. The sun's going to be back. Even today, a peak of sun, but along with that, a hit or miss shower. I'm thinking again, lower to mid 70s over the next, say, four to five hours, 70 at five o'clock in the evening. About 73 for a high in Central Falls, 74 downtown. As we uh, take a look out over the West Bay, Garden City, Riverside, and Barrington in the lower to mid 70s. Uh, right around 70 in Charlestown, Newport, 75 Coventry, while Northern Rhode Island, with the help of a little bit of sun, maybe getting up as high as the uh, mid and upper 70s. A spot shower, southeastern Massachusetts near 75 in Fall River. So the bay today waves one to two feet. Visibility, it's not bad, five to 10 miles in a high tide was this morning at 10, low tide at about a quarter past three this afternoon. Tonight, an early shower, then drier with clearing skies. Tuesday, beautiful near 80 with sunshine. I want to quickly show you the tropics because there's a system that we're watching well out into the Atlantic right now. It has the potential to become a tropical depression or a tropical storm over the next day or two. Just a reminder that we're in hurricane season. No threat to land anytime soon. We do have some more wet weather on the way for the middle of the week, Wednesday afternoon into Thursday, and then a warm-up for Friday and into the weekend. We could be well up into the 80s for Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Your updated forecast 24 hours a day on the Pinpoint Weather Station, Cox Digital Cable Channel 125. So the sun is technically still up there somewhere. Somewhere. We haven't seen it, but <laughs> I'm guessing yes. Okay. Thanks, Michelle. So